going to make a cruelty-free cowhide rug for your home or for your space. So if you want to learn how to make this, keep on watching. To do this, you're going to need a few things. First, I have upholstery fabric. I ordered this online and it looks so much like the real thing. It looks like cow leather, but it's not. It's cruelty-free. Next, you're going to need rug liner, and you want enough that covers under your fabric. Then you're going to need extra strength double-sided tape. Lastly, I have some markers. This will help me trace out my design. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is lay down my fabric, and I want the wrong side facing upward, and then I'm going to layer the lining on top of it. I have been trying to work on this project for like ever. I have tried to attempt to do this three times already and I've been having issues with adhering the lining to the fabric. We've tried all sorts of glue and I almost gave up on this project. You guys have no idea. All right, so after spreading the lining onto the fabric, I'm going to fold this in half the long way. Okay, so after I folded out everything, everything is laid down nice and flat, I'm going to draw on my cowhide pattern. Now the great thing about this is that it doesn't have to be perfect. Now you guys know that cowhide is like kind of squiggly and wiggly. Um, so, you know, the less perfect it is, the more realistic it will look. I recommend for you, if you feel a little bit nervous about, you know, the drawing part, look up a picture online and use that as your reference. So let's go ahead and do this. I'm going to freestyle this. I try to make the most use of my fabric so that way I don't have to cut out so much. And I think it looks pretty good. I'm ready to cut along the tracing line. And as you're doing this, if you change your mind, you know, it's okay. You don't have to cut exactly what you trace out. You know, before cutting, you could actually lay down your double-sided tape so that way this doesn't have to move. I wish I'd thought of that first, but since I'm already cutting, I'm gonna go ahead and just cut around this. I cut out everything already. Now it's time to lay down some double-sided tape. I'm going to take a strip of this and I'm going to lay it between my fabric and my lining. And it stays on, it sticks perfectly. Wish I thought of this long before. Actually, I did suggest this, but Eric didn't believe me. So, guess who's right, you guys? Me, the professional. DIYer. So I'm going to add on little strips where I made the curvy lines like this and just repeat this throughout the rug. Alright guys, we are officially done. What do you think? I love it. I love it so much. It's very eclectic and it adds like a nice, like, I don't know, it adds a nice artistic feel into the space. Um, I'm really happy with this. And if you guys like this video and like the fact that this is cruelty free, give this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends or anybody you know that would love to make this as well. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. I make weekly videos every Saturday. I make lots of how to's and DIY's. So come on back. Make sure to subscribe if you have not. It is free. All you have to do is click on that subscribe button. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you soon. Ciao!